just a quick update here on Mark. Obviously, as you saw, was uh, injured uh, last game. Uh, we've got good news. We, we, in our mind, dodged a, the big bullet um, where it could have been, um, you know, long term. We feel uh, obviously we're going to we're going to IR Mark for right now. He'll be out um, with that for obviously a week. We're going to monitor it on a on a week to week basis. Um, I can't sit here and give you a timeline, but it's certainly the good news is is this is not um, as long term as we initially feared. No surgical procedure, um, nothing of that nature, and it's just going to be. We'll get through this next week, which um, will be the first week off, and then and then just monitor it. And hopefully he's back sooner rather than later. But um, certainly good news from where we were. Two nights ago, thinking that this could be, uh, you know, something that uh, could keep him out the rest of the year. So, um, hopefully, back sooner rather than later. We'll monitor it, and probably the best um, thing I can give you is, is is probably a better sense a week from now. Um, once uh, once we once we know a little bit better, in terms of identifying a a return date. What, what was you... the <laughs> what was the worst that you were fearing and? Well, I mean, any of those things. When you, you, if you if you have to get surgically, in, in, uh, if there has to be a surgical procedure or intervention, then you know we don't have a, uh, a long time left in the season that, that he's out for the remainder of the season. Then obviously that's that was uh, you know we dodged that bullet. And apologies. Was, yep. it, was this a hamstring uh, strain, or what's the official diagnosis in front of us? Well, you're right. It's hamstring. You got it. You guys. You got you got the body part, so um, we'll leave it at that. I mean, it's a hamstring injury that um, that we just we're gonna work and hopefully get him back sooner, as soon as we possibly can. Obviously, given his importance to the team, we mm -hmm. talk, talk all the time. How you know devastating could have this been, and how you know from that standpoint of what he means to this team, how relieving is this? Well, I mean, anytime you lose players, it's you, that's not what you want. Um, but at the same time, whether you miss a guy for a game or for or longer, it's a hole in your lineup. So now you need people to step up, right? Um, it's oppor you know not only opportunity for other people, but we think we've got good players that that now people have to absorb this loss. That's that's at this time of the year with the with the race that we're in, every every game is so important. Um, that you never want to have people out of the lineup, but that's the reality. I mean, the reality is you're going to have injuries. It's how you deal with them. And the good news is we're going to get Geo back. We just don't know when yet. Um, but until that such time, we can't sit around and what was me. Now it's I mean, we got we got a big game tonight and and Saturday and, and so on and so forth. So people need to jump in here, and um, you know that's our expectation that they will. How difficult will it be? Oh, yeah, I mean, the, the good news with Gio is we say this, he's, he's over his career, he's been a fast healer. But, you know, you also have to, there's no sense rolling out there. You, can, you, when, you know, playing hurt and playing injured are two different things. And, uh, you know, until he's back and he can be a, um, he can contribute to the team, then you've got to get him better. But the good news is it's, it's not going to be as long as we might have thought going home on, Tuesday night, so that's good news. Some relief for Mark too, in that sense. Then, yeah, always. Yeah, yeah always. Um, again, you're missing time. I don't want to. I don't want to say that it's not a loss because he's not going to play tonight. And, and like I said, we got to. We're, we're going to iron. So the next little while, we're going to. We're going to miss him. But um, it, it could have been worse, right? So um, as a player, you're always. You hate missing time. Mark's, you know, sour that he's going to miss any time, but. Again, you always have to look at it and say that it, it, it could be it could be worse, right? How do you feel about the depth on your blue line with Geo out? Well, I mean, you, we've got depth on the you know we've got depth there. Um, you're taking your top player out, so that's it's always going to have an impact. But like I said, you 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 have to. It sounds cliche-ish and all the rest of it, but it is next guy up, right? So now. People absorb those minutes. You're not going to replace a Mark Giordano. We went through this my first year, right? Um, it was similar time too. It was actually right before the deadline, 
And <clears throat> you know, we said back then that you don't you don't re you don't go out and replace them, but everybody gets you know pulls on the rope a little bit harder, and and uh, and that's what that's the expectation now. So um, you don't replace Mark Giordano, but you, you you have guys that jump into into the fray, and I've yet, I've yet to meet the player that says you know play me less and give me less responsibility. You know they all want more. Here's an opportunity to get more. Does this not uh, in any way um, change or adjust? approach as the trade deadline approaches? Uh, I mean, you're always, you've heard me say a long time, what, 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 what you do, you take your cue from your team at the deadline a lot of times, so you continue to do that right now. Um, obviously, our situation right now with Mark's injury, you know, we're, we're, we're in a different situation than we were 48 hours ago. Um, good news is we're in a better situation than we were maybe 24 hours ago in terms of his timeline. Um, We'll see, is all I can say, Jermaine. Continue to watch the team, continue to, to, to see where, you know, ways that we can Im improve our team. Um, it may or may not, we'll, we'll, just have to, we'll just have to see. How personally was this for you the last 48 hours? Because, you know, it could have been obviously a lot more devastating. Oh yeah, but that's just the game. I mean, you you, you have injuries, right? You you deal with stuff. So um, certainly knowing that he's not going to have to, uh, we didn't know, right? Until you got to go through that process, and that's why it's always you know, it's good. Take a deep breath. Let's let's go through. Get let the docs do their thing, and uh, you get the word back. But you never like to see a player leave. But that's the game, right? You 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 you, you have to have the next guy step up to the plate. But I'm certainly glad that. We'll see him back sooner than maybe we thought we might have seen him a couple days ago. Is that uh, Brandon Davidson? Excuse me? Brandon oh, Davidson yeah. Right good, good call, Pat. Um, <laughs> um, first time we've heard that, Pat. So, but um, <laughs> um, um, Brandon Davidson, so uh, Gio's been IR'd, which Davidson's been recalled. Brandon Davidson's been re recalled, so he's out in the ice there. Yeah. Just a thought on the actual play because it was so innocent looking and it was such a you know, strange <coughs> oh the geo play yeah, yeah it was it was it was it really was I know probably everybody's seen it now but you know he went from okay he's got an open net that he's shooting the net and puck into that didn't go in and all of a sudden he's not getting up right so you um, you didn't know at the time obviously it is you look at it his leg stretched out kind of awkward you didn't know if it's an ankle a knee a groin. Um, and uh, they happen, right? It, it's the game. Stuff happen. Stuff happens. So you cannot, like again, the morning period can't be. You got to move on. You know, nobody feels for, sorry for you. And everybody gets the injuries. You know, everybody deals with injuries in this league. It's, you know, the the good teams are able to overcome. And and like I said, you don't replace them, but you 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 find a way to, um, you know, get points while he's out, and, and hopefully he's back sooner rather than later.